Hey guys, Bill here. You know, stingrays and manta rays come in all different shapes and sizes, but the coolest ray in all the oceans for me is the shark ray. In the front, they're broad like a ray, but in the back section, they're all shark with dual dorsal fins. How cool is that? Also known as the bowmouth guitar fish, this large species can reach a length of 8.9 feet and weigh up to 298 pounds. And now the bad news. If you want to see one of these guys up close and personal in the wild, you're going to have to go to the Indian Ocean or the Western Pacific. And for me, that's way too far away right now. But I did find a place in the United States where you can see them. And believe it or not, it's in the middle of the Mojave Desert in Las Vegas, Nevada. In one of the biggest resorts in town, there's a major aquarium with full-grown shark rays in it. It's called the Shark Reef, and its main tank is filled with 1.3 million gallons of water. Now, this aquarium displays all sorts of stuff like sharks, fish, rays, reptiles, even a green sawtooth shark. But the real celebrities here are the shark rays. Step inside what they call the shark tunnel, and within seconds, you will have a very up-close and personal encounter. Guaranteed. Not bad for an aquarium, huh? Shark rays are not dangerous to humans. They like to eat crabs, lobsters, stuff like that. But their numbers in the wild are dwindling due to overfishing. They're killed for that shark fin they have on top. It's the main ingredient in shark fin soup, which is popular in certain parts of the world. Attempts to breed these amazing creatures in captivity so far has been a failure. Seven pups born at the Newport Aquarium in Kentucky all died within a few months of their birth. And that, my friends, brings me to the question of the day. Do you think keeping these giant shark rays in an aquarium is a good idea or a bad idea? Let me know what your opinion is in the comment section below.